In this morning's Business Insight, it's time to step up to the plate. Step up to the plate is a foodie event, my favorite kind, that benefits Camp Possible, which is run by Talbert House. Camp Possible is a therapeutic-based summer program for children ages 6 to 12 who struggle with behavioral health and need a safe, structured, and stable environment beyond their classroom. Step up to the plate is Saturday, November 5th from 6.30 to 9.30 at the Phoenix. Event co-chair Peter Hiltz, who was a trustee of the Harold C. Schott Foundation, and Nick Nikki Boberg, Associate Director of Youth Behavioral Health Services at Talbert House, overseeing Camp Possible, joined Business Courier publisher Jamie Smith in the studio with more. Thanks, Peg. Guys, thanks for being in today. Thanks Thank for having you. us. It's always great for me to hear stories of uh, things that Cincinnati's doing, you know, especially for the youth. So let's talk a little bit, Peter, first about what is Step Up to the Plate? What's it all about? Well, Step Up to the Plate, Jamie, is the 13th annual Talbert House Culinary um, party. So, hey, I love parties. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> <laughs> For sure. And uh, it's actually going to be on November 5th down at the Phoenix downtown from 6.30 to 9.30. Okay. You're going to raise a little money, we hope, right? We're going to try. All right. We're talking about raising money. Obviously, the, the proceeds of this goes to Camp Possible. Tell us a little bit about Camp Possible, if you would. Absolutely. So Camp Possible is a therapeutic structured day camp. We, most of our students and our campers are not able to be successful in a traditional camp setting because, as you said, they have behavioral health challenges. So at Camp Possible, we teach them positive behavioral choices and then reward them for making those behavioral choices. And we do this through a variety of mediums. We do group individual therapy. We use music, Legos, martial arts. Um, in the morning, we teach these skills, and then in the afternoon, we give them recreational enrichment activities okay. so to be able like to apply camp. those skills. Absolutely. We also take them on field trips once a week to different um, different places throughout the city that they may not otherwise be able to go to, like the Freedom Center, the Reds Ballpark. Um, we've done different things throughout the last couple of years. Oh, that's awesome. So. Well, talk a little bit about the fundraiser. What makes it unique? I mean, obviously, you're talking culinary, so I'm a, for assuming sure. there's some good food there. Yeah, I mean, this event really is for, for the foodies, and what makes it unique is we're throwing the party. Yeah. Actually, we're going to be bringing in some of the best restaurants in Cincinnati. We've got Jeff Ruby's The Precinct, We've got National Exemplar. Uh, we also have um, the Golden Lamp. Oh, yeah. So, so I think we're going to be uh, very excited to... I uh, have a lot of people at this event. Uh, well, I've got my table already. I can't wait to get there. I mean, any, any time food's out, I'm ready to go. Uh, but it sounds like a fun event. I have not been before, but I'm looking forward to it. I think there's a silent auction yeah, well, as well. Or you know, a little different. Little we're, offers. Yeah, we're going to have um, some friendship bracelets that we actually made at camp yeah. with the kids. So you'll be able to purchase those as well as fill up a tent with balloons. Uh, to actually send a kid to camp, oh, either for a day, a week, or the full program. So that, how much does it cost for you know to send a kid to camp? Do you, I mean, you break it down like that. We do. So the cost is approximately fifteen hundred dollars for per camper for the eight week session, oh. and that goes to you know the supplies that we need, the different activities that we do, field trips, food, as well as transportation. That's awesome. Now, is there, uh, this is the first year at the Phoenix, correct? This is. Uh, we brought it down to the Phoenix. feel like the location is great. It's beautiful space. Uh, that's great. Well, I appreciate everything that the Talbert House does. I'm learning learning more about it every single day, but it's just great to, to you know, help kids, you know. So, hope it's successful. We'll have you guys on again. Talk about the success. That's great. Okay, and I you. do want to go ahead and thank our sponsors oh, who made absolutely. this possible. Uh, Fifth Third Bank. Mercy Health and the Harold C. Shot Foundation. Oh, excellent. Well, thank them, and uh, we'll look forward to, to supporting y'all. All right, thank thanks. You. Thank you.